Hey guys and welcome here we will give you useful tips to solve many problems. Here we will talk about a problem with a virtual box manager that appears in Windows. I think if you still watching you know what it is a virtual box manager. This is a software that can help you to run any version of Windows or operating system you want on your device without formatting it. But as any program we may face some errors while trying to start it. For this problem we will go and I follow the following steps to solve it. In just a few steps we solved it. First we need to go to Windows features to disable some features and enable other ones. Here we need to scroll down and find Hyper-V, disabling Hyper-V by unchecking the box. After that we gonna scroll down again and locate the Windows Hypervisor platform to enable it by checking the box near the text is here. Then enable the virtual machine platform in the same way. Finally in Windows features screen we need to disable Windows Sandbox. For those who do not know this feature this allows us to temporarily run virtual Windows 10 on our device for testing purposes. We talk about it on our channel here. And to confirm this just go and click on OK you are gonna see that Windows will search for required files and apply the changes and everything should be OK. You will ask to restart Windows but we will postpone it for a few seconds later as we need to do one more thing. Here we going to search in the start menu to find the PowerShell tool. Run it as administrator. Now we need to run this command by copy it from description below video. to make changes take effect. After the restart, run your virtual operating system with no error. Hope we were able to help you. Enjoy, do not forget to subscribe to know more.